Hey guys, it's me, Jack, just tuning back in. It's been a while. Uh, last summer I updated the anamorphic lens kits and I wanted to come back and give you guys some news. I've been tinkering with Blender 4.2 a little bit and found a solution to the floating point error that was plaguing all the uh, the vintage lens kits for a while. Uh, if you don't remember, that was floating point error that if you moved away from the origin point, it would start to degrade your image quite a bit. It was frustrating and it really put a really put a limit on how you use these lens kits uh, but that's solved now and I can move the camera anywhere and it seems to be working just really really well so I hope you guys use it and I also push it to the free file so you can see and prove out even the 28 millimeter looks really well and I made that one free because I hated it so much uh, but it's, it's very usable now it's pretty So I'm gonna, I'm in the process of updating the anamorphic lens kits as well with the same fix, and just know this is only for Blender 4.2. Um, while I was doing that, I had a, somebody on Twitter reach out and say, "Hey, I really want to try shooting, um, you know, simulate shooting with this 178 millimeter medium format and large format lens." Um, so I cooked it up and realized, "Oh man, this is a Boca machine, Boca monster." and it looks really good. So I threw that into the photography kit as well. So if you own the photography kit, you, you can just download those and all the different uh, film plates and stuff. And three, I think I have three variations of that lens going on. So, so I'd love to hear what you think. I'd love to see your art with this stuff. And if you're someone who's gonna say that this has been done by this person already or this person or reminds you of this video, just look at the date stamps and uh, draw your own conclusions, okay? Fucking hot. This is probably terrible lighting. 